Hi guys, welcome to Real Girl Thrift. My name is Angie and I resell clothing online to make an income. So I go to thrift stores, I find name brand clothing that resells well and then I take pictures of it, I take measurements of it and I list it on Poshmark and eBay. So if you enjoy reselling related content and you're not a subscriber yet, please consider subscribing to my channel. I would love to have you. I do thrift haul videos. I do what sold videos. I do some thrift with me videos and just reselling tips and tricks that might be beneficial for you on your journey as well. So today's video is a two part video. The first part of the video, I'm just gonna kind of talk about my summer reselling strategy. And then the second part of the video, I just have a little small little thrift haul for you of some items that I found today while thrifting. So to talk about my summer strategy, um, I am a stay at home mom of, I have one daughter and she's about to turn five. So she's been doing preschool for the last three years, two days a week. So those two days a week, I get to, um, while she's in school, I'm able to thrift and work on reselling. Um, so I obviously won't have that time anymore with summer coming up. And then also on Mondays, my mom does a preschool for uh, my daughter and her a couple of her cousins. So that also won't be happening as much um, about in about a week and a half. <laughs> so... I need a summer strategy for my thrifting and my goals. So I'm gonna share with you what I'm gonna do. Uh, please feel free to comment down below your summer strategy for reselling. For me, I'm not, this is not gonna be the time where I'm gonna really like ramp up and like try to add more to reselling. What I'm going to do is I'm going to um, I had mentioned in a couple videos ago that I've upped how many items I list per day on Poshmark and eBay. So for the summer, I'm actually going to kind of reduce it. I'm still going to list uh, most days of the week. I'm going to work on listing new items, but it's not going to be as many items. I'm going to reduce that number um, just for my own sanity and because summer is a little bit slower and also because more, most importantly, I want my daughter to have a good summer. I don't want like the stress of her feeling like I'm just constantly focused on getting a minute so I can work on reselling. I really want her to enjoy her summer and I want to enjoy it with her too. So that's kind of why my strategy is to keep listing every day. I take about one day off a week of listing just for my mental clarity, <laughs> but I do, otherwise I do list every day. So I'm gonna keep listing every day. I'm gonna keep sharing my Poshmark closet. I have a Posh, Posher VA that does that for me. Um, if you wanna check out my closet, it's actually called Way Too Cute 33. You can check it out. Um, so I'm also going to, what I tried to do was I tried to get kind of a stockpile of items so I didn't have to take my daughter thrifting with me for the summer, but I have maybe like a week's worth of things that I can list. So I still am going to have to go thrifting with her this summer. And if it doesn't seem like a good day to do that with her, then I'm going to ask my husband if when he gets home from work, if I can have a day, one day per week during the summer, after he gets home from work, if then I can go thrift for a couple hours. So that's my strategy with that, is just kind of asking for help from my husband. And um, I think it, that about sums it up what I'm gonna do this summer. Also, um, if I find items that are fall or winter that are at a good cost and that are in style and season and all that, I'm gonna go ahead and pick it up now. So I'm not only trying to find summer things because what I wanna do when my daughter uh, starts school, so she'll start school in the fall and she's actually gonna be in kindergarten. So she'll be doing five days a week. So when she's in school, back in school, I'm really going to focus on listing a lot more, getting more inventory, growing my reselling business. I'm gonna start a podcast. Um, I'm going to be uploading on YouTube more once fall hits. So that I'm really going to be pushing once fall hits because that is like the time to resell. Um, that's when 
Um, they call it quarter four, where you get just like the most sales. It's just really booming. It's a great time to resell. So yeah, that's my strategy. Please share your strategy and your thoughts down below. How are you going to do summer for reselling? What's your situation? And now the second part of this video, and you can put any questions down in the comments too. I'm going to show you what I found at the thrift store today. So I found 10 things. Um, I spent about $5.80 something cents per item. So that's kind of like around where I like to keep it per item. So I'll just go ahead and show you what I found. The first thing is actually, it, this is a new with tag Lily Pulitzer top. And um, this I think is like a, I think it's off the shoulders little top, really cute. So it is called the Anna Knit Top in Sea Dreaming. So there's the little tag, Lily Pulitzer, very pretty. That should do well, obviously new with tags, can't complain about that. Next up, this is not really a summer piece, but it is Duluth Trading Company. And this is a size medium. And this is a little, um, it feels really soft. So it's a long sleeve. I feel like this could be an outdoorsy shirt or this could be, you could even wear it at work. Um, really nice fabric. It's got some little side zipper pockets to it. So just a real like classy little top. I'm going to move my coffee because I don't want to get coffee stains on stuff. Ah! And I don't want to um, have my phone be a bonkeroo. Um, next up, we have the brand Judy Blue. These are a size 728, and these are the skinny fit jeans. So this, even though skinny jeans aren't really in anymore, this should still sell. It's not gonna sell for like a whole lot, but I like um, right now in summertime, I like to do quick flips um, because I just like to pick up items and get some money, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, those that's those pants. Next up, um, we have some Levi's low pro straight jeans, size 27. And this skinnier little tag is gonna be a newer, some of the newer Levi's. Um, so they have this like blown out knee um, to them on both sides. And obviously a really nice straight leg jean. So I'm hoping these will do well. Wanted to go ahead and pick those up. Okay, next up, I have a couple pieces. Um, this is a brand that I love to pick up in the spring and summer in dresses because it seems, it doesn't sell for like a whole lot, but it's a quick flip, which I love. So we, it's Matilda Jane. I don't know if you can see from that tag. This is a size small, and this is a little um, floral dress a little cinched at the waist i think it does it have pockets no i don't think this one has pockets this one i've actually found two other times this exact dress and i don't think they're sitting in my closet anymore i think they are sold so if you see matilda jane for a good cost you might want to pick it up i have another matilda jane this is also a size small and this is a maxi dress so this one does have side pockets. And this is like a really pretty plum purple color. It's got this little tie. I don't know yet if you tie it around the front or the back. Um, here's the back. And let me show you the little Matilda Jane little logo. All their stuff should have this on there. Okay. Next up, we have some Athleta leggings. These are a size small, and these are a cropped legging with some mesh detail and some cool design. And here's the back. They looked a little bit newer. Um, 
I will have to look at the style name. You know what? Actually, I could have checked it in the store. Okay, I guess they're not that new, but they're in great condition. Fall of 2017. So I'll have to look those up and see what they are. Um, they do have a inside drawstring waist, which I love. Okay, next up, I was thrifting today and I was kind of thinking, man, I wish I was gonna find something more exciting. And then not too long after I had that thought, I actually found something exciting, which Johnny was, this is a size extra, extra large. So that's a great size. And this is a little floral embroidered tunic dress. So I know this will do good. I do wanna mention, Here's the back. It's got this pretty embroidery on it too. So <clears throat> please comment down below if this is your thoughts or you've noticed this. But I've noticed that Johnny Was doesn't sell for as much as it used to. Um, I might find like a shirt or a tunic and think I'd sell it for maybe $60 used. But now I'm seeing like the, the cost is going down a lot. People aren't like liking it as much um, and they're not paying as much if you're noticing that too please comment down below but I still get excited when I find it and there's no way I'm gonna pass it up if I find it unless like they mark it up to like $25 or something but this was four dollars Johnny was so of course I'm picking that up okay next up we have by anthropology and I don't always pick up anthropology, but I'll tell you why I picked up this. This is a size small. So these are some velvet leopard joggers, jogger kind of pants. And I picked it up because leopard um, was in season um, last fall. So I'm thinking it's still gonna be a thing. Plus by anthropology, you know that that's a newer anthropology. So I went ahead and grabbed these because they're more unique um, and honestly I was kind of lazy in the store to check the um, like the style on these and to see what they were selling for but I just went ahead and grabbed them because I felt like it'd be worth it. They're unique enough. Okay this I think is my last thing I picked up and I saw this on a rack that was ready to be put away but these are some really cute American Eagle, um, oh my goodness, why can't even I think of what that word is? Um, overalls, little shorts, jeans, overalls, distressed, super cute. So I had to grab these. I mean, these aren't gonna resell for a whole bunch, but I think they'll get good attention and I think I'll be able to at least triple my money. There's American Eagle and these are a size small us small so i thought that was a good little pickup so that is my haul for you guys today thank you so much for watching i don't know if my camera's doing some weird coloring there maybe because of that pretty tree behind me um so comment below how you've been doing what your summer strategy is and i will see you next time bye